For every single person living in the world, life is a journey, and every one of those journeys is different. But to know that that journey could end at any time, and we have no idea when that might happen, makes me want to make that journey as wild and memorable as possible. My life has been about the outdoors that I like to call the world around me and just having fun no matter no, no matter what and being creative in the ways that I that I do that. The Wizard's Eye Expedition just isn't about getting to these crazy places and flying off the top of mountains or kayaking down waterfalls. It's about being upside down in the bilge of the boat or having your head down the toilet or or having hydraulic fluid sprayed in your face trying to fix the steering and, uh, and it's, a, it's a whole other challenge. It's taking me out of all of my comfort zones and for me that's when I feel most alive and I'm having the most fun. So I think that having a Cabo day is being present, being able to appreciate anything that's going on around you and being removed from all of the comforts in life is a huge part of that and for me this trip is just being able to bliss out have humor and enjoy even the most hardest of times and to allow those hard times to make the good times peak even higher than I've ever known before. <laughs> what I would say to the 16 year old is sitting in English class daydreaming about things that they would rather do is that that's the first step to success and that dreaming big being able to dream as crazy as you possibly can is the first key to, to success other than that it's stay in English class you gotta be able to follow through with what you need to do and a lot of times that takes doing things that, that you don't necessarily want to. To pull off the, the Wizard's Eye Expedition, I sat in coffee shops typing on a keyboard for years, trying to drum it up. The other thing is don't ever quit. Most people that quit are this close to success by the time that they do that and they don't even realize that. I'd say the other thing is just to Think a little crazier, think outside the box, be able to uh, be able to just appreciate yourself and your own wild ideas and to be able to feel confident and comfortable in that and know that not any person is the same and that your wild, crazy idea, even though it might not make sense to most people out there, as long as it's a genuine expression of yourself, is exactly the right thing to be doing. Along this journey, I've had good times that I've never anticipated. I've had hard times at the times that I never expected. And at the end of the day, it allows me to reflect back on all of it and know that it was the best time ever and that today is the best day ever and that at the moment, we're coming to the end of another Cabo day with amazing people in a wild place, on a crazy beach, on a desert island. What could be better than this? This is awesome. I have a bintang hiding behind a rock. That's better than this. <laughs>